Don't fear failure. As long as it's not gonna kill you, it's gonna make you what? Stronger. Another day, another vlog. <laughs> so welcome to the HN vlog. It's been a rough week. Like most businesses, now not every day is a great day, but uh, you know, it just I was watching uh, something on YouTube today, and the top YouTuber, the top money earner on YouTube is a kid. I think I don't. I, it's not even a teenager maybe 12 13 selling toys toys guys making millions of dollars selling toys or recommending toys to other kids and it, it just hit me man it just hit me this is the best time to be an entrepreneur there's so much opportunity in any field possible there's nothing you cannot do and make money at the same time you know there's so many options compared to back in the days. And even my generation, we had options, but there's even more and more option now with this digital world. It's opening door to a whole new spectrum of, of businesses, man. I mean, I've never heard of my generation, and surely now my parents' generation, where you got kids making millions. Not one, not two, uh, I was reading another a young is 15 you know and he's making half a million uh, a month half a million on social media you know and you hear stories like this now all the time it's not even about followers anymore how can you turn your followers you know to 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 consumers you know how can you you know brand yourself and that's what I want to talk about even though now there's so many options there's a, so much competition, man. There's so much competition. There's You can't do anything without somebody else doing what you're trying to do or copying you or, 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 or you know, jumping on your idea. It, it, th th those days are over, you know? When you have those times where uh, you, you it, it took maybe a, a few years before you came up with something it took a few years before somebody else copy you and all those things. Those days are over. There's so much noise out there, you know. So that that and and the question is, with with all this noise, you know, how do you differentiate yourself with your competitors? How can you stand out, you know, to the, this huge crowd, man? And it's a huge crowd, guys. I mean. Um, I don't care what field you're in. I mean, some fields are more competitive than others. I wouldn't be a fintech business, for example, unless you're able to raise millions of dollars. But I truly believe that while you're building your business brand, you have to build your personal brand. They go hand in hand now. It's just the only way out. Because your business, whoever you are running your business, your business is its own brand. But whoever is running the business, it's a brand also, you know, because investors get so many requests, customers getting, you know, bombarded with all kinds of requests for, for the same service or similar service. You know, attention spam now, it's like a few minutes. You know, you lose a consumer just like that. You know, so if they, if they cannot connect to the brand and connect to you, as, as you running the company, you know, it's very difficult. You know, you never used to see, you know, like uh, you see the Zuckerbergs uh, on the media heavy, uh, te uh, the, the, the CEO of Tesla, forgot his name, heavy, you know, is it's his own brand, but it's connected to his company brand. And that's separate. I mean, electrical car is nothing new. I mean, of course, he's, he's a smart dude, but it's nothing new. Why, why he's not buying a Ford? Why Tesla? you know, as so big, you know, they didn't, they were not the first one uh, building an electrical car, but that CEO have built such a strong personal and business brand that, you know, people associate 
that type of technology, electrical car, to 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 uh, Tesla. And I can say that about a lot of stuff, you know, e-commerce. Say, same thing, you know, uh, with Amazon. So what I'm trying to say to you is very simple, you know. If you if you about to start a business, you got to build your personal brand also. And what I mean by that, you got to you got to stand out from the crowd. You got to show to 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 your investors, to your consumer that you you are the right person to deal with. You're the right person to to lead this industry. You know, you're the right person to bring the solution to this particular problem. It's not by accident I do all these videos and YouTubes and 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 on on different social media aspect and all those things, you know, it's to stand out from the the the, the competitors, show that you know what we're doing. First of all, to prove that we are actually doing something, you know, I, I remember some of the investors I was talking to. They wanted a proof of uh, our technology, you know. So it's proving, showing our our impact, showing our services, showing what we what we uh, accomplished, show the evolution of our technology. If you go, if you go on our YouTube channel, you can go back a few years, you'll see the progress, the pictures and all those things. It's not by accident, you know? I'm not trying to do this to, to get famous. I ain't gonna get famous of this stuff, but I wanna separate myself from, from the competitors, you know? I wanna show that I'm the right person to lead this thing. So I have to build the, the business brand, the brand and the personal brand. You know, and that's the only way because there's so much noise. So number one, you gotta, you gotta. Uh, if you're shy, if you're scared of uh, 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 the camera, uh, then get over it. You know, find a way. Number one, number two. You know, if 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 you start a business in a certain field, technically you should be an expert in that field, and educate, 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 educate educate share your experience share your challenges whatever goes through your mind you know but give value to your content i repeat give value to your content you know because again why your company why somebody's going to come to you uh, to solve their problem you know but you have to build that trust you have to show them that you're the right person so that was the point of this uh, uh vlog man build a personal brand in parallel to your business brand you know that's the only way you're going to separate yourself from your competitors first of all thank you guys for watching the videos i'm working on a project right now that i'm truly truly passionate about and with your participation we can truly achieve this goal it's called the 50k challenge Out of every 20 books we sell, we'll be giving one to a student or young entrepreneur. And out of every 500 books we sell, I'll be giving you mentorship for one week to a young entrepreneur. I truly believe with your support, I can achieve that goal, guys. So share the books. If you haven't got it, get it. If you don't like to read, buy it for somebody else. And please share it also on social media. Thank you.